Saponification, turning oil into soap. Saponification, turning oil into soap. Introduction Soap has been an essential part of our daily lives for centuries. Whether for personal hygiene or cleaning purposes, soap is ubiquitous in households and industries around the world. Have you ever wondered how this everyday product is made? The process behind soap production is called saponification, a chemical reaction that transforms oils and fats into soap. In this article, we will delve into the fascinating world of saponification, exploring its history, the science behind it, and its modern applications. A Brief History of Soap The use of soap dates back thousands of years. Ancient Babylonians are believed to be among the first to have discovered the cleaning properties of soap, around 2800 BCE. They made soap by combining animal fats with wood ash. Over time, different societies improved and refined the process, developing various soap-making techniques. The Science of Saponification Saponification involves the hydrolysis of fats or oils, triglycerides, with an alkali, typically sodium hydroxide, NO or potassium hydroxide, CO. The reaction results in the formation of glycerol and the respective salts of fatty acids, known as soap. When sodium hydroxide is used, the resulting soap is solid, while potassium hydroxide produces liquid soap. The chemical equation for saponification can be expressed as follows. Triglyceride plus sodium slash potassium hydroxide glycerol plus soap. During the reaction, the alkali breaks down the ester bonds in the triglycerides, releasing fatty acids. At the same time, the alkali ions combine with the fatty acids, creating soap molecules. The glycerol produced acts as a byproduct. The process of saponification Traditionally, Saponification was carried out using a batch process. In this method, fats or oils were mixed with an alkali solution, and the mixture was heated and stirred. The reaction typically took several hours, during which the mixture was left to cool and solidify before being cut into bars. In modern soap making, a more efficient technique called continuous saponification is often employed. This process involves the use of specialized equipment that allows for a continuous production of soap. It typically consists of a controlled reaction vessel, where the triglycerides and alkali are mixed and heated under carefully controlled conditions. The process is faster and allows for greater automation and higher production volumes. Controlling the saponification process is crucial to ensure quality and consistency in soap production. Factors such as the ratio of fats to alkali, temperature, and mixing conditions need to be carefully monitored to achieve the desired outcome. Variations in Soap Production The choice of oils or fats used in saponification greatly influences the properties of the resulting soap. Different oils have varying fatty acid compositions, which impact factors like soap hardness, lathering ability, moisturizing properties, and cleansing power. For example, oils rich in saturated fatty acids, such as coconut oil, produce a hard and cleansing soap that lathers well. On the other hand, oils high in unsaturated fatty acids, like olive oil, yield a softer soap with moisturizing properties. Soap makers often combine different oils or fats to achieve a desired balance of properties. This is often seen in artisanal soap production, 
where manufacturers carefully select oils to create unique and specialized products. Application of Saponification Soap is primarily used for personal cleansing and hygiene. It effectively removes dirt, oils, and bacteria from the skin's surface, helping to maintain cleanliness and prevent infections. Beyond personal use, soap finds extensive application in various industries. Cleaning and detergent products, including laundry soaps, dishwashing liquids, and multipurpose cleaners, all rely on the saponification process. Soap's ability to emulsify oils and fats makes it an efficient cleaner for a wide range of surfaces. The cosmetic industry also heavily relies on soap production. Bath soaps, hand soaps, and shaving creams all require saponification to create the base products. In recent years, the demand for natural and organic soaps has grown significantly. These soaps are often made using vegetable oils and natural additives, appealing to consumers seeking eco-friendly and skin-friendly options. The Science Behind Natural and Sustainable Soap With the increasing demand for natural and sustainable products, soap manufacturers have embraced alternatives to traditional soap making. Many are adopting the cold process method, which preserves the natural properties of oils and allows for the inclusion of nourishing additives. In the cold process method, oils are carefully measured and mixed with an alkali, usually sodium hydroxide. This mixture is then left to undergo saponification naturally without the need for external heat. The result is a soap that retains the beneficial properties of the oils used. Natural additives like essential oils, herbs, and clays can be incorporated into the soap mixture at trace, adding fragrance, texture, and color. These ingredients not only enhance the sensory experience but also offer additional benefits for the skin. A growing trend in soap making is the use of plant-based oils, such as olive oil, coconut oil, and shea butter. These oils are rich in nutrients and fatty acids that nourish and moisturize the skin. Plant-based oils also have the advantage of being renewable and sustainable, supporting eco-friendly practices.